So we've only found out recently, probably only within the last 10 years, that um, men's sperm quality contributes to miscarriage. Now, from the days of Adam and Eve, we've always thought that once a woman got pregnant, anything that happened thereafter, whether it was a miscarriage or a live birth, was all to do with the woman's body and the woman's eggs. But actually now we realise that the quality of a man's sperm has a big impact on a miscarriage whether it's just one miscarriage or whether it's recurrent miscarriages, this is very closely linked to the sperm DNA quality. So this has now been recognized in Europe and the, the European um, guidelines have shown that there is this strong link between sperm DNA damage and miscarriage. So the guidelines are suggesting that men ought to be um, uh, told about this, this risk and also that they should be um, recommendations should be made for them to improve their lifestyles. For example, if they smoke, to stop smoking if they can, to, um, to get, make themselves as healthy as possible, because this has a big impact on their, their partner's um, ability to maintain her pregnancy.